Let's go. Welcome back to the 11th episode of the Dan Geesing Live Gaming Show. Really excited to get going today because it feels like it's been forever and a day since we played Braid. I don't even remember what color his hair is. That's not completely true. He's a ginger. But uh, really excited. I think we're really close to wrapping this up. And when I say really close, it really depends on if my memory and logic can stretch beyond that of a young squirrel, as you guys know how I like to refer to my memory as, and see if we can actually crank this out tonight. Really excited because I think, um, you know, I'm interested to see what happened. What is Mr. Braid and his blue blue blazer, uh, what is he so distraught over? Why is he going back in time? What does he need to undo? Hopefully you find that out tonight. Um, so let's get right into it. The schedule for tonight is very similar to other Dan Geese and Live gaming shows, but I promise you we are going to start switching up the end. We're going to start out with uh, the first three segments are going to be all about Braid, see how far we can get, and then we're going to round out uh, the night with some Spelunky Death Rat where you guys get a chance to bet on how you think we're going to fail. I just I have the feeling tonight, tonight's the night that I think we finally beat Olmec, and um, it will be a celebration to be had. So... <laughs> Really looking forward uh, to that. I think it's going to be a good show tonight. I think, uh, you know, we, we've had a, a little bit of, of trouble uh, pressing on in Braid, but I think each show has gotten a little better. So because of that, I, I just, I'm just i feeling confident tonight. And uh, so that being said, we're going to jump right into the game here. And uh, real quickly, I want to thank uh, Sam, DG Support, Amy, Randy, Glendon, that's a new one, uh, Sergeant Wiggy, Jessica, Colleen, thank you guys so much for retweeting uh, the tweet that I sent out regarding um, the the stream that helps to grow the channel. I truly appreciate that, and Ryan just sent in another one. Um, I appreciate that. So, that being said, we're going to jump right into this and uh, get some braid action going. Tonight is the night. I hope so. That's what one can only hope for in this situation. All right, so where we last left off, we had just finished uh, one of these rooms. Uh, or one of these worlds, I believe. Uh, we read these, so we're at world five, technically speaking. Um, but it's really world four, because we have never been to world one just yet. So now that you're thoroughly confused, um, let's uh, see what kind of action we got here. See if we can get anything. It looks like a chalkboard. Is that a chalkboard, or is that not a chalkboard? Looks like, and every picture thus far, there's been wine. So maybe that doesn't go like that. That looks definitely like upper right corner. Is this like a little wedding action here? That looks like it should fit there. But it doesn't. Alright, so... Okay, so we got our pieces here. Let's go ahead and, and jump in and see where we left off. Uh, what is going on, Shamed? Um... Ryan, Prodigy, what's up, everyone? Good to see you guys. Let's, uh, okay, so we knocked out, looks like, three of seven worlds here. So this is where we last left off, crossing the gap. And I think, um, for this one, we're gonna... I don't, do we normally, we normally don't have the chat up during Braid, so I'm gonna take that down real quick. Because I believe that is hindering our progress at the current moment. That's normally for Spelunky, so that is my fault. I take all the responsibility on that one. Let's go ahead here. There we go. All right, so as we remember, I think uh, pink means it's immune to... Never mind. I thought pink meant it was immune to... Uh, to the time flow here. All right, this shouldn't be too bad. What is... That's kind of awkward looking. That bent over... Ooh, wow. Alright, so we're already to our first rewind of the night. And that took about 10 seconds. Um, you met Arn Anderson. Uh, I'm not familiar with who that is, but congratulations on that. Alright, so maybe we need to kill him and then another one shoots up? Yes. 
So he's gonna fall all the way here. Does that do us any good? Yes, it does. Hoping we can use that to jump here and get this easy piece, right? No, of course it wouldn't have been that easy. Oh, I forgot we have Locksmith here. I forgot about that, uh... The mechanic of, uh, the Shadow Braid. I completely forgot about that. Alright, so... How do we... That's how we get him going, right? Alright, so this is like Clone World. I forgot about it. See if we can hurry up and kill this guy. Nice. You gotta cross both there. Now we've got a hustle. Is that thing still not there? It's oh god. That's not what we wanted. We want to keep this guy up here. Alright, so right now we're just kind of grasping at straws. We know we need to keep that guy on the top level here. Now how do we do that again? We need to get that done again. What's up, Gort? Good to see you, sir. Come here, sir. You do as we say. Go! Oh, he's dead. No! Okay, so this is... Difficult, sirs. <clears throat> Let's uh, do this. Let's see if this works here. Can he beat him there? Nope. Alright, so somehow we keep screwing this up. Alright, maybe this is the way to do it. So, you come here, sir. We've got to make sure that he stays up there. Why isn't that guy doing work? See, I don't fully understand that mechanic. I think I feel like that's going to cost us some valuable life. It's too fast. So close yet so far away. Actually, you know what? Let's uh keep it alive. Keep the hope alive here, sir. Not gonna be good enough. Nice. Oh, a little too fast. So confused here. The confusion is real. I've I tried Elder Scrolls Online Beta. I tried it like a month or so ago. I actually had a chance to play it at E3. And uh, it was fun at E3, but I'm just uh, not into it right now. I didn't play in the big, uh, the big beta test they had going. So I think what we're trying to do here is, is get him across both bridges while we're up there. Which is... Uh, very, very interesting. Alright, so this is... We're just going to rewind this whole level. Because we're off kilter right now. We're on tilt. The beta ends tonight. Got it. What's up? Dan fan, sir. Get up there and pull that trigger. Does he have enough juice? He does not have enough juice to do that. How'd the Hearthstone tournament go? It was good. Uh, there was a few upsets and it was fun. I think it was the most we've ever had play in a tournament before. And, uh, I think it was strong to quite strong. Alright. Oh, 
Okay, we need him to pull that, but when do we need him to pull it? I guess that's the question. Okay, let's pull it back right now. Not like that. Pull it, sir. We need that guy dead. This is very, very difficult. This is an extremely difficult level. See, I don't get why sometimes this guy follows you and sometimes he doesn't. That may work for us here, though. Go! Flip that switch, sir. Flip it! Nice! I think we got it by some steed. Oh. I think we got it by some steeds majestic. Okay, I think we're right here. Do it, sir. No. So close. Oh, that thing got through. How did that thing get through? We had it. We had it. It was there. Like Royal Rumble of the Hunger Games. Would I ever do a Minecraft tournament? I don't exactly know how you would do a Minecraft tournament, considering there really are no rules, Blake. We had it, and we screwed it up. You start here, sir. Alright, now hopefully we can make it up. It's okay, you can die, sir. It's not what we wanted. It's problematic. I feel like we're chasing a dream here. Unless he does that. Kill it. Nice. Okay. No. We had it. Okay, so. Actually, go kill it. Jump like Fackler. What's up, Randy? Flip it. Yes, let's go. We finally did it by some freak of nature. All right, we got one down. I would love for him to cross back. Okay, good. One's down. We're almost there. Let's keep the let's keep the power train going here. No, sir. You do not. Come on, don't fall. Okay, that's not enough. Oh, we had it again. It's all right. Okay, I think we're okay now. Well, I think that was the hard one. So we got... No, no, no. Oh, we just wrecked it. Full on just wrecked our piece. Okay, let's calm ourselves. You, sir, are not supposed to hit the switch. There we go. Okay. Let's just take our puzzle piece and, and keep it keep the good times rolling at home. Alright, there should be puzzle piece part two. Okay, good, we got action. Now the real question is, what next? Do we just jump on it from this high? Oh, close. What 
happens if he does that? Huh. Now this is going to be very interesting because... What is the deal with this thing? I feel like that's something we need to work on there. Can we get land on top of that door? What's up, Eureka? I feel like, uh... Like, there's looks like there's something to this thing. But there's nothing really we can do. Like a magic carpet or something. Hmm. Unless that's just a red herring. I don't know. Ooh, what we would need is we would need to get two of those guys in there somehow. Very interesting. Huh. Oh, sir. Oh, so close. I don't know. This is very confusing. I feel like this has something to do with it. Because why would that be... Uh, I guess not. There's nothing back here either, right? Nope. So it can't, maybe we're making it too confusing. Can't jump on top of the door. Can we jump from up here? Nope, can't make that. So weird. Yeah, you just have to collect in this game the, the point is to collect the puzzle pieces, but I feel like it's something that we have no clue how to do. <laughs> I don't know. I am, uh... I don't want to throw the towel in just yet, but... Can we jump on him? Nope. There's got to be an answer. There's always an answer. And this jazz solo is not helping our situation either. Could I be jumping too soon? I don't know what the other option would be. It doesn't really matter there. We need to get multiple jumps on it, but I'm not sure there's a way to do that. he kills both of them in one shot. Why is that magic carpet there? Unless, I don't know, unless we clear this board somehow. can't make that jump.
What's up, sub? Unless the, we just do it the old-fashioned way. I like that, sir. What if we, uh... We can't... If we get, like, one double jump... I guess we, here's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to try to jump on it, then bring it back and jump on it again. So essentially we get two, two jumps for the price of one. It doesn't work like that. Vincio, what's up, sir? You are a uh, Hearthstone champion. Welcome back. Alright, for anyone that's beaten this game... Is anyone here beaten this game already? Confusion lurks in the air. Well put. No worries, Kraft. No worries. Okay. Do it, Big TFC. Okay, so you've beaten this. Let me... I'm going to ask you a specific question. Is this beatable currently, or do I need, do I need to press on and do something? That's my question to you. Rayonic, same to you. So do I need to press ahead to another level before I can beat this? Try a 360. What's up, Golitz? It's currently beatable. I'm such the biggest troll out here. I don't know. You can do it now. Okay? Let me ask you this. Kind of like Simon says. Am I, am I remotely close to a solution? Or am I extremely far off? It's really hard. It took you a while to figure it out. I'm okay with really hard, I just want to know if I'm on the right track. Lukewarm. I just, I know we need two of them there, I mean... I just don't know how we separate them. Use the shadow guy. So we're trying, but the shadow guy doesn't really offer us anything. Any value. All he does is kill the guy for us. Unless we do this. If he kills... If he gets killed by him, does that help us at all? Does he get, like, stronger? Alright, I'm not opposed to trying that. Okay, that's not the right move. See, that guy just... He's such a waste. So, uh, I feel like sometimes we have a clue what's going on. In this case, okay, 
Okay, I guess the other thing would be to get him to another level. Which I don't think it's possible. It'd be awesome if we could get him up here. I don't know. Let's try something else different, I suppose. Maybe there's a way we can get him through it. Because I don't see any jump mechanism that's going to help our cause. They just run in this carpet. I'm so, uh, And the confusion is real. Um, I'm just trying to think, am I forgetting anything? I don't know how to manipulate the situation to, uh, to make it for the good stuff. not the answer when he finds out I won't feel so intelligent I mean I don't think I'm overthinking this I just don't that is not the, the way the truth I don't know what I'm missing here either I'm getting close. I'm getting close to uh to the need. Can you jump twice on you can, you, if there's two of them you, you can jump on two consecutively and then get a uh, a higher jump but there's only one here. The only option is we could jump from a higher place, but... What's up, Gravy? Don't kill him, you jerk. I almost had it before. I'm struggling. This is Struggle Street right now. I just trying to think. Is there any way to get him a double jump? There's not a way to get him double jump. Can we jump off the top level? That's my only second guess. Is jumping off the the high ropes. Get back there. We're gonna do one more high rope jump here. There. Not even close on that. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Wow, come on. <laughs> Is this gonna help us? <laughs> no. Alright, I'm going to take a quick break and return. Hopefully we can finish this level. So much for beating the game tonight. I'm going to take a quick three-minute break. The uh, the ads support the channel, so don't use ad blocker. I'm gonna, if you don't get ads, you're going to listen to some glorious family jewels 7x. I truly appreciate you guys tuning in. Don't go anywhere. We are going to beat this. I'm going to set up. When we get back, though, I am going to set a five-minute time limit and say, all right, enough's enough. Then I'm going to ask for a specific tip, but not until I ask for it. I'll be back in just a few moments. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, and uh, I'll be back in a few. Freaking trolls. All right, let us press on here with our uh, our braidness. We uh, we got a five. I set a, a timer here. We got five minutes to figure this out. Although I know you can't uh, you can't rush greatness known as braid. Um, I do have a few specific questions I have in mind to kind of start peeling back the layers of what to do. That's our highest point. It's not gonna get it done. Oh, you 
jerk. He stole our kill. So I guess my only... I feel like the closest we've come is by hitting him in midair. And so I'm going to try and do that. Oh! Is that it? Is this... Come on. Oh. Dang it. Oh, come on. Come on. So much pain and agony. Let's just see how it goes. Don't jump, shadow guy. So I guess this is the, the furthest location we can get to it, is right there. Okay, so... So close. What's up, guild goo? Oh god, he almost, that guy almost made it. So close. That's like half an inch. Oh, jerk. Alright, so here's my first question. And this is a rarity. My first question is, am I on the right track? Do I just have to hit him at the perfect location midair? Am I completely, completely way off? Way off. Get a running start. I can try that. No, I am doing it wrong. Wait a second. Can we jump off him when he's being already been hit? If so, here's what we could do. We could have him... Like, hit him. I don't know if we can double jump off that, but let's try. So let's have him do that. I'm going to see if I can jump off the... To catch him midair. What I want to do is see if we can jump off his dead body. And that that's a whole different ball game. Doesn't look like it. Shadow guy's really salting our game. And we can't jump off Shadow McGee. But okay, so say the clone hits him, then what? Alright, let's try it this way. That's not gonna do anything. So let's try- I don't know what to the freak to do. This one requires outside the box thinking. Wait a second. Do 
we have enough time to jump on him twice? I just want to see if another one comes back in time. No, by the time he gets here. So, we, we gotta have to do it the one. We can't double jump, so... What the freak? Does he have a better jump radius or something? Baffled. This is about as as baffled as one can get in this game. Uh -huh. Are you kidding me? I guess that's all it takes, huh? A jerk. This guy's such a jerk. I guess that's all that ha had to happen one time. Just get your face down there so we can jump on it. Get out of this level. Bunch of jerks. Um Gildy, watch the spoilers, man. I asked for that's a it's a slippery slope, I'm not even gonna say anything. Let the moderators handle it. Alright, we got a key here, sir. Got some puzzle action. Give us key. We're gonna need that to jump on, aren't we? Go pull it, sir. Oh, what a troll. Yeah, I guess my only hope is that the, uh, the moderators can catch spoilers before I see them, but what are you going to do? That was a pretty, this is pretty easy. What's up, Space Aladdin, sir? That was very straightforward one. That wasn't too difficult. What else we got on here, sirs? At least we're, at least we're making progress. That was a very difficult level, though. What are you going to do? All right. Um, Where is the other piece? That's interesting. Oh, this is kind of cool. So... I think we're going to have to use him twice. I think I screwed that up. Ah. All right, so here's what we need to do. We need to start this over. You go there, sir.
Let me get up there first, though. Alright, let's start over here. So... You come here, pull the trigger. Let me get up there first. Thank you, sir. Okay, so then... Pull the trigger here. I hit it, did it again. Damn it. Spoiler alert, there will be other spoilers as long as they're to the internet. I would say that uh, our channel is, is strong to quite strong when it comes to spoilers. Everyone does an awesome job with it. So um, let's go ahead and maybe start here. Okay, we gotta get this figured out. Cause I can't get, get greedy and do a double rewind. That's what happened last time. Too much, too fast, sir. All right, so let's start him here. You come here. Then you come here. That gives us plenty of time here. Yeah, vague tips are, when I get stuck, I ask for vague tips. All right, so now let's pull this. If we pull it again. Pull it, sir. Pull it. Good man. All right, we did it. Two more pieces down. We are cruising now. That was that that other jump one was just I guess something we I didn't know that they would propel off of that. So, we know now. All right, let's press on here. Got to find a key. I don't see a key anywhere. Oh, it's around his neck. Come here, sir. Okay, I think we lost them all there. So I think we gotta go rile them up here, huh? There we go. Alright, so how do we... We gotta hit him five times. This is gonna be interesting. There's one. Come here, sir. Cut it. Nice. Got another cheap shot on him. Nice. That shadow cheap shot. That shadow. Take all the, sh the shadow cheap shots for you, sir. Give us that key. Is there a piece back here? I believe so. So the question is now, where do we go? All right, so we're gonna have to unlock this. And then pull it. Alright, go ahead and do that, sir. Good man. Oh, he took the key from us. Oh, he ruined our whole schedule, that jerk. Alright, let's press on. Okay, so, we just go here, 
And then he's gonna follow us, so let's pull this. Pull ye old key card. Let's go ahead and rewind it. There you go. Go do go do your work, sir. I don't know what that thing does, but I'm guessing it does something good. Okay, so it looks like we've gotta be right there when he does it. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to sit there and wait for a minute. So he's going to come here. 1,001, 1,002. 1,003, 1,004. Alright, do it now, sir. Hopefully he gets there in time. Open sesame. Open sesame. <laughs> Alright, so I think we just have to time this a lot better. So maybe if we start it here. Oh, how do we go that? I wish you could go fast forward in this game. One more shot, sir. Alright, we're gonna here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna climb up and then we're gonna stall just for a quick second. So we're gonna go here, thousand one, thousand two, thousand three, make it happen, sir. From right there, go. Go do good things for good people. No. Pull it. Nice. We're out. The completion is real. Fragile companion. All right, that guy looks like he's uh, being tough, McGee. Oh, it's one of those keys. You can only use them once. What's up, Skywise, sir? Let's see what else we got here. Is that the whole level? That's the whole level? This looks like we have to do a lot of shadow boxing in this one. That's weird. Why don't I design a game? <laughs> Why don't you design a game, sir? What? This is going to be a tough one. What is this level called? Fragile Companion. Maybe it's just a... Maybe it's just one big troll here. I want to see if we can... Come here, sir. Wait a second, he can come pick up that key. How do we get him to open this? We need to we need to get him in front of us somehow. He's got his own key. Fragile must be Italian. <laughs> Wait a second. No, okay, here's what I want to do. 
I'm gonna make him inadvertently pick up the key. So we're gonna hopefully knock the key on that ground in front of us. Like so. And then perfect. That's where we need it. So really this is what we need to do. We need to We got to get the key in that guy's hand like so. How do we get him in front of us after that? This is going to be another troll level, I think. Do I think we're going to beat it tonight? I think we got a shot. How do we get him to pick up the key? We need to get him to do something before we even do it. That's the hard thing. So we've got to get... Here's what's in my mind. We have, we have to get the, him... I guess here's what we would do. We would start here, run here, run back, and then go kill it and see what happens. I think that's the move. Now we just gotta time this perfectly. Do it. I want him to start here. That's where, that's where we need him to start. Run here, run back, and go kill. It's not the right way. Start right here, sir. Run here, pick up the key, run and open it, and then we're gonna go kill this thing. Not there. I think we're close. I think we're close. Wait, see, we didn't even open it that time. I was looking at the chat instead of watching the spoil of our victors. I think this is it. For Start here. Get the shadow man on screen. Run here. Pick up the key. Open that. Open it. And then we'll see what happens. Go pick up the key, dude. Run here. Run back. Open it. Now let us go kill something. I didn't run it back, dang it. All right, one more time here. We got it. It's right on the tip of our braid. All right, you start here, sir. Load them up. Run here. Pick up the key. Run back. Open that up, sir. All right. Now, got to time this up. Nice. So time it up nice. I don't think that's it, though. How did we get him to pick that up before? I guess it all starts with getting the kill here quickly. It's because I don't fully understand the mechanics. That's the problem. So I want you to run here and run back, sir. Now go do it. Run there and run back. Got it. Okay. Once we have the key in, key in our hand, it's too late, I think. You believe. What's up, Day? Run here. Wait for the key to drop. Run back. Open that up. 
We got to do it before he disappears. I got it. Okay. Quickly, dude. He's going to disappear. <sighs> Messed it up again. The physics are an issue as well. Shadow guy sucks. Shadow guy is definitely... Uh, maybe we just have to put it here. Just go there. Open it, sir. So we literally have to drop this right on his cranium. Why does it start from there? That's the issue. I think we fell into it somehow last time. Alright, let's give it one more try. Shadow Guy needs to step his game up. So whatever we're doing there is not working. But this is the only thing that is working for him to run there. Start here, sir. Run there. Pick up the key. Run back. That's the money. That's the money. Do it now. Why does it start from there? That's what I don't... Oh, there we go. Alright, we'll take it. I, I have no idea how he did that, but I'll take it. I do, do not understand that... Uh, how to control the shadow guy at all. If you understood the game mechanics, you'd have it. I don't understand the game mechanics. I understand what to do. I don't understand how to make him do it. That's the, the freaking hard part. All right, world five is done. Let's put this uh, bad boy together here and see what we unlock. The puzzles. Looks like a fish tank. Give us the sutures. We need sutures here. All right, this looks like a suture. Where's the double sutures? There's the double sutures. All right. Looks like he's playing pool, drinking alone. Is that right? Where's that missing piece? Not there. There we go. It's like we're piecing together the storyline. What's he doing? Just chilling by himself? Solved World 5. So he spilled some wine. Cheers the wine. Oh, we're missing a critical part up there. Alright. Um, you unlock another shadow guy. Okay, so we're going to take a quick three-minute break. In return, we're going to check out World 6 for the last segment of Braid for this show. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Don't go anywhere. I'm going to run three minutes worth of ads. The ads benefit for the channel. Thank you guys so much for not using Ad Blocker. You guys are the best. Uh, if you don't get ads delivered to your particular region, you will get some Family Jewel 7X delivered to your region instead. Enjoy. I will be back in three minutes. I'm going to go inhale some air, and I'll be right back.
All right, let's press on here. We are going to uh, hopefully knock out another world in Braid. I'm feeling fairly confident. Thank you guys so much for sticking around. And uh, let's check out World 6, shall we? What does the old purple World 6 have to show for us? All right, now story time. Hesitance. Perhaps in a perfect world, the ring would be a symbol of happiness. We're talking about a wedding, it sounds like. It's a sign of ceaseless devotion. Even if he will never find the princess, he will always be trying. He, will, he still will wear the ring. Smeagol's ring. But the ring makes its presence known. It shines out to others like a beacon of warning. It makes people slow to approach. Suspicion. Distrust. Interactions are torpedoed before Tim can open his mouth. Little Tim. <laughs> In time, he learns to deal with others carefully. He matches their hesitant pace, tracing a soft path through their defenses. But this exhausts him, and it, and it only works to a limited degree. It doesn't get him what he needs. Tim begins to hide the ring in his pocket, but he can hardly bear it. Too long tucked away, that part of him might suffocate. Smeagol. Alright, let's, uh... It's snowing here. Why? Slow motion. That's kind of cool. Oh, you leave the ring behind, though. And it puts everything in slow motion. Whoa, that's crazy talk. That's slow motion. Alright. There and back again, a hobbit's tail. All right, so now we have the slow mo cam. How is that going to affect life? We probably are going to want to slow down Justice McGee here. I'm going to guess that. No, we don't want to slow down Justice McGee. Oh, wait a second. I see what we want to slow down. Drop the ring, Smeagol. All right, go for it. Get the money. Go get the money. Get him the money. That freaky music. Get him the money. It's like glue. Get him the money. I said get him the money. Get it. I'm, are we going to make it out? Nice. Get him the money. Nice. That Drop that Smeagol phase question mark. I like this music. You cannot drop the ring midair. Okay, so maybe we drop it here. No, I don't think that's it. I'm guessing maybe we drop it on a specific pillow. That's what we want to do. We want to drop it on one of these pillows. Drop the ring. Oh, let's go. Oh, we have to pick it up though, huh? Do we have to pick this thing up? Pick it up, dude. Drop the ring. <laughs> Drop the ring. No! Nice. Alright. This guy's love life is messed up. All right, I think uh, we just gotta go get go get the one ring that rules them all. <laughs> that traffic jam. <laughs> this is such a like, it's a very well designed game. No one's can ever take that away. Drop that beat. This guy's love life is so messed up. <laughs> all right, what do we need to do here? Same thing.
Wait. Drop it. Or not. Do we drop it up here? Nah. Just put it on the ground. Perhaps. That ring of pride. Or is that too close? Is that going to get it done? We still need that thing to shoot out fast, but... That's too far away. What's up, Blake? Wait, that only shoots one out at a time. Huh, interesting. I wonder if the thing above it is just like a misnomer. Very interesting here, sirs. Hmm, so this is not as easy, but this only shoots one at a time. Huh. More than meets the eye with this one. What happens when that crashes? That's the real question. It's slow-mo drop. Unless it drops through here. Huh. That impatience. Let's put it right in between. I'm gonna guess it's gonna, cause one's gonna have to shoot out fast enough. Enough to give us time to get there. Wait for it. No. Okay, so that's not working. Maybe you just gotta move it. Just move it into the, the, uh, the briar patch. What's up, Miranda, on Instagram? Oh, that might have been the one right there. That's close. That's the money. That's the money. Oh, slow that beat, sir. No, oh, so close. So let's think about this. We're really close here, so what could we move? I guess we would need to move it further away this way so it can respawn a little faster. Let's try that out. Spoilers in the fridge. Before you started watching this, you were saying. <laughs> Wait for it. This is, uh, but this is, uh, we're learning about what, what games are good for the show and what are not. I feel like we came out of the gate swinging with... Oh, so close. With, uh... Super Meat Boy. And, uh... With every game we play, I think we're getting a better feel for what what's good on the show and what's not. This is, uh, I think it's just a matter of placement here. Oh, you 
control. Shoots out one at a time. Where's... Can we, I guess we could do it, drop it, and pick it up. That doesn't make any sense whatsoever, though. Where do we want... We wanted to go slow motion right here, I think. Can we make that jump? We cannot. We don't want it to go slow motion right there. We want it to go slow motion right here. No, because we can't make that jump. What's up, gamer with fluff? Welcome to the channel, sir. Is this how it's done? This may be it right here. If you guys are new to the channel, I encourage you to uh, hit the follow button because we do have three shows a week. Come on. We don't have Shadow Guy in this one, do we? We have no Shadow Guy, we just have the ring. What's up, Snipey Snaps? The Ring of Pride must be thrown in Mordor. It needs to be thrown somewhere. I don't think that affects anything, having it up there. It does not. That's slow-mo. Wait a second. It'll put our jump in slow-mo. So we'll have that wicked air time. That's how we do it. Get that wicked air time, sir. That's it. That's the answer. Let's go. Okay, we just gotta move it now. That sneaky rat bastard. Nice. Get that wicked air time. Oh, come on. Nice. We did it, sirs. Let's go. Have I, have I been watching Olympic snowboarding? I, although we have some big time hops, I have not. Oh, there's a lot going on in this one. More than I'm willing to admit. So first off, we have to stop the violence. The violence must be stopped. So how do we stop violence? Alright. We want to get this guy there, so how do we stop this violence? Oh, give us that peace, sir. Let's go. Okay, so one piece down. Got that one piece nugget. Extra dipping sauce. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, what else can we do here? We need to get that jumps right here. That's not enough to get it done there, sir. We need to get double time. How do we get two here? I think we drop it. <laughs> Where's the other one? Shoot the other one quickly. Oh, idiot. Idiot. Fall, sir. We need to get those double hops. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. We gotta get double hops here. How do we get double hops? <laughs> we just got lit on fire. Alright, 
Wait for it. <laughs> oh, so close. So close. We're on the same plane as him. Let's go. <laughs> Miss the jump. Trying to get a double jump here. Should actually try to hit on that first bounce. <laughs> Having too much fun with this ring. There we go. Not enough. <laughs> okay, that's not the way to do it. <laughs> Let's just see what we're working with here. Awesome. This game is actually really fun. It's just you got to use your smarts. Let's go. Which is something that we don't want this thing in there. We want it right here. Oh, you jerk. Oh, we should have hit that. Wait, wait, wait. Now. Faster. No. Now. Oh. There it is. Oh, come on. You got to hit that perfect, sir. What? Oh, we hit it. And then I wrecked it. Jump off his face. The face jump. Oh, that was perfect. Stamco spell check. Whoa. Okay. Got to have a perfect face jump. That's early face jump. Late face jump. Late face jump. Wait, wait, wait. Too late. I'm trying to face jump off one and face plan off the other. Like that. He's too slow. Alright, so it's not right placement then. That looks a little bit easier to try that. Just gotta get to the other side. This game is crazy, by the way. Purely awesome, what's up, sir? Face jump once, oh god. What? You've literally got to hit it right in the sweets. Sweeties! Oh, fail. That patience.
Can we jump on one and then slow mo the second? Nope. <laughs> Look at those slow mo trolls. <laughs> Dang it. Now. Oh. So random. <laughs> we gotta get a double air it. This game takes some serious patience. Let's go! What? There we go. Alright, we lucked our way into that one. Now we're just down to the last one. Which is, we need the key. Alright, two pieces down. We're gonna press on here. Now, how do we get the key? I think that's the way. Look at his face. Okay, we're too slow of a jump. So, where do we want to slow them down? Let's talk this one out. So, we really want to slow them down right here. I think. No, that's not true. So, maybe slow them down here. No, we want them fast all the way up until we're, we can jump on. But maybe we, uh, wait for the last possible second. There it is. Give us the money, sir. Give us one more money. Batman it out, don't talk it out. Oh god. Let's go. I think we went too fast on that one. Now what? Okay, we're up here. Should we wait until there's two in there now? Flamed. Actually, you want the flames going pretty fast here. No, it doesn't matter. It should be obvious now. We just gotta double jump, right? No, okay, we just gotta keep hitting him on the far edge. See, they're not coming out fast enough. Oh, I was trying to pick that up and jump at the same time. Hmm. Nope. <laughs> I'm 
What's on American Idol tonight? All right, let's try to get up there one more time. And see what happens. One. I jumped too early. One. Two. Now, all right, we're going to let one go, and then we're going to jump on the second one. That should be enough to get it done. I'm hoping. Quickly. Oh, we screwed that up. Double jump. Oh, so close. You literally got to jump them right out of the can. Come on, dude. Oh, let's go. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Always trying to make it too c complex on ourselves. Alright. We're going to finish this level. Okay, we got the key of, of goodness. right in the grill hole. Alright, so this has to be sharp placement. Jerk, put the ring down. Quit being Smeagol. Jumping off his face, dude. Stop jumping off the wall. So nervous with that ring in his pocket. Alright, let's just get out of here and see what happens now. Okay, we're gonna have to think this one out. So, how do we delay these shots? I don't think we can outrun that. Team Jamaica. Unless we could slow down the actual... It shouldn't be this difficult. Make a run for it, Marty! Oh, God. Alright, made it. Should be Rap City now. Unless we die. How do we get out of here? Oh, are you kidding me? How do we get out? That's the question. With the Sam? So hard. Let's try this. Can we pick it up as we go? Ah, uh, that's what we can do. I 
think. This is freaking hard, man. I thought this part would be easy, but who are we joking? Pick it up. Make a run for it, Marty! Oh, God. Go! That still doesn't make sense. How are we gonna get out? Nelson! Hey, can uh, one of the mods make sure that new people understand how wh how we like to keep things in the channel? And you guys are like, you guys are free to, uh, to clear that chat message. I don't know what this does, but since it was spoiled, we might as well try it. I don't know what it matters. Get out of your life. No worries, it's not just a, it's there's multiple mods, so it's not just one person. Alright, since we have the key, I don't want to uh, let the key go to waste because the key was very hard to get. can't get out. That's a problem. How the hell do we get out? Is there something we're missing? I don't get it here, sirs. You know what? There's a way to... If you guys could... There's a way to just time the message out and not clear the entire chat. I think that's the best way to do it, if at all possible. Is that cannon shooting lions? It's, it's it's shooting like goombas or something. All right, I'm gonna give us the old college try one more time. That just makes it di more difficult to beat here. That may work. That act this actually may be the, the solution here. Go for it. No, that's not the solution. There's got to be another way out of here. I would think there's another way out of here. I don't think there is. It's 
we don't have those jumps. Can those bodies block a shot? I don't think so. Maybe they can. Maybe that's the way to do it. I don't know here. Answer here. No answer here. Just about out of braid gusto here. Does that make it even slower? Try that out. Maybe that makes it even slower. Almost. We're almost there. Now. Oh, so close. There it is. That's the money. Oh. Alright, I think it's just it's just ring placement that matters. So close. I think this is it. I think this is the money. Give us the money. It is not the money. That's not even well, I guess our other option would be to jump right on the cannon itself and put the ring on the cannon. That may work. Let's try that. But to do that, we've got to slow these jabronis down. We've got to get this guy through in the clear. So let's go ahead and try that first. So here's the plan. We're gonna. This is gonna be our last attempt for the day. We're going to see if this will get through. Get one of these guys through. Which it looks like it's going to get through. All right, he made it. So then we're gonna use him. Not you, jerk. We're going to use him to jump on the, the cannon and freeze that cannon. I think that's the answer. It's like a freaking... That guy needs to die, though. Oh, why do we get stuck there? This is... Looks like we got to do some more slowdown. No? This is it. This is the answer. Just got to wait for that jerk all right so close that was it he's got to get to the bottom floor though sir there we go jerk almost home almost almost So hard, you gotta clear this guy, clear this guy, let him fall. That's the money, let's go. Your life is over here. Cannon. Alright. Alright, looks if someone keeps spoiling, then just time him out for ten minutes. Get him uh 
Invite them to, to to taste the rainbow. If if you warn someone two or three times, then just toast them after that. Two times maximum. And have them taste the rainbow. I'm lucky I didn't see any of that, so... Trolls can keep trolling, doesn't matter. Alright, we cleared this level. We got some braidness. That's all that matters here, sir. Let us press on and get through this. You guys can keep the ring. Let us press on. Alright, impassable foliage. We are going to save for Wednesday. I'm going to take a much needed inhalation of oxygen break. I will be back in three short minutes when we return. I'm actually going to open up some Spelunky Death Roulette here. So you guys can get your bets in. I'm going to take a three-minute break, and um, we're going to get the Spelunky bets open. Place your bets. We're going to beat it this time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, the ads benefit the channel, so I appreciate you guys not using ad blocker. And if you don't get ads served your way, you're going to get a little Family Jewels 7X served your way. Enjoy.